here with Jeff Osef, head coach of the UMC men's basketball team. Obviously a tough loss to Bemidji State tonight. Uh, go out and have it a pretty close game in the first half, but then they kind of late in the first half and then into the second half go on a nice little run to extend it out to a pretty pretty good edge, but you guys kind of claw your way back into it. Just just what, what went on today and what you know what led Bemidji State to a win and what led you, you, know, you guys to a loss tonight. Well, first of all, I think Bemidji's got a good team. You know, they're, they're a senior-dominated team, mm -hmm. and uh, they got a lot of guys who can shoot the basketball, and, and that puts you does they stretch you out defensively. But I thought we were doing all right there. I, I thought when we had a chance to kind of really put it tight, mm -hmm. you know, we missed free, three free throws in a row. You know, mm -hmm. that end up being probably six points if you make them. Well, six points in a game that was at that particular point pretty close, everything gets a little tighter. You mm -hmm. know what I mean? And I just, we didn't do that. We didn't make those free throws. That was big. Uh, and I just thought they were really efficient what they did. Uh, we, they, I thought their defensive pressure at times bothered us big time in the first half. I thought we had set, you know, I think we had seven turnovers, but I think that led to a bunch of easy buckets for them. Mm -hmm. So that means we were turning, there's good turnovers and bad turnovers. Those are bad turnovers when, when mm -hmm. they, they go for easy buckets. Uh, they put a lot of pressure on our perimeter guys. We knew we had to get it inside. When we got it inside, good things happened. But uh, we just didn't, just didn't stick to that game plan well enough. Second straight good outing from Almir Kurzalic, uh, 16 points after, I believe, 17, 18 points the last time out. Just how, how is that just getting that great production from a senior leader like Al? Well, that's how it should be. Yeah. You know, I mean, obviously he's scoring a little bit more than I thought he would be, you know, would do, but mm -hmm. you know, we, we don't find scoring any easier from anywhere else. So he's got to take that over and, and get some shots and get some, because he's being pretty consistent of, mm -hmm. of shooting the basketball, which is great. You know, mm -hmm. you know, Al's got a tough gig there. You know, he's the point guard and, you know, it's not an easy deal and he also got to score some buckets. He's got to guard their best player, but Al, Al can do it, you know, and we just need the other guys to come along and, and be, be ready to go, be focused on mm -hmm. what's, what's happening at times. And I just thought, we had some mental breakdowns, and I thought in the second half we did exactly what we wanted to do. We got it inside, and then we missed three shots in a row down there. You know, I mean, I, yeah, you can't you can't get easier shots than that, and, and they don't they didn't go, and uh, because they didn't go, uh, they did. We, you know, we I think we cut it to ten at mm -hmm. some point. Yep. And then and then we just couldn't get over that hump again. I thought we took a charge and we got technical. You know, it was so it was just a it was it wasn't a good forty minutes of basketball for UMC tonight. You've got a tough weekend with two of the tougher teams in the South this weekend in Upper Iowa and Winona. What do you know about those two teams, and what do you need to see from your team in those two games this weekend? Well, they're good. You know, Winona won a couple national titles not that long ago. Yep. I remember those. I was there uh, going against them. And Upper Iowa's kind of got to turn around a little bit. You know, they got they got to play pretty well. And, um, you know, Upper Iowa, down at Upper Iowa is going to be a tough game, and Winona's going to be a tough game. There's not an easy game in this league, and, mm -hmm. and this will be this will be really very challenging. What do we know about them? We know they're good. Mm -hmm. We know they're good. And, uh, you know, what can we do? We'll see what we can do.